Hi, everyone, and welcome back to A Plus English. I'm Erin, and I'm Laura. So, Erin, are you feeling any cooler in the hot weather? A little bit. And why is that? Because I'm wearing a new hat. Um, is it a beret? No, it's not. I'm only wearing jeans and a T-shirt today. Ah,、oh, 穿牛仔裤跟这个 T-shirt， 那应该是很休闲风。Oh, so you're wearing a baseball cap? That's right. It protects my face from the sun and looks cool with my outfit. That's great. You'll be happy to hear that we have more hats to talk about today. Oh, I can't wait to find out what they are. Well, you're in luck because we're going to start day two of our article right now. All right. Hats, hats, hats. 请在美剧朗读后一起跟着念哦 Let's go. Straw hats. Keep the sun out of your eyes with the straw hat. You'll look fashionable in one of these hats. While you're by the pool. Bucket hats. These hats first became popular thanks to rappers. Today, many fans of this type of music. Enjoy this cool style. These hats look especially good. When you pair them with casual clothes. There is a perfect summer hat out there for you. You can wear a fun hat to keep cool. This is also a nice way to make you look good. Try wearing your favorite hat today. And see for yourself. While, while, please be quiet while your brother is studying. Please be quiet while your brother is studying. Pool, pool. It's so hot today. Let's go swimming in the pool. It's so hot today. Let's go swimming in the pool. Cool. Cool. Mark thinks that he looks cool in his new jacket, so he wears it everywhere. Mark thinks that he looks cool in his new jacket, so he wears it everywhere. Especially, especially, Rebecca likes fruit, especially strawberries. Rebecca likes fruit, especially strawberries. 
Let's find out what the first hat is right away. The article tells us we're going to talk about straw hats. Okay, 我们马上来看一下今天要介绍第一种类型的帽子，就是 straw hats， 也就是草帽。不过其中的 straw， 大家可能会觉得，嗯，这个字看起来很眼熟。它可以指稻草的意思，或者是我们喝饮料的时候的那个吸管。So a straw hat probably has a Big brim, right, Laura? Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Brim 呢，其实就是帽边或是帽檐的意思。所以通常 ，Yeah， 草帽好像就是都有很大的帽边。I guess so. Uh、mm-hmm. huh. And I thought so. Which is why our article says, "Keep the sun out of your eyes with a straw hat." Oh, okay. So, 一开始呢，我们文章就提到，就是戴上草帽可以让阳光不直射到你的眼睛哦。这里呢，就是 keep 有那种防止这样子的意思哦。All right. So it not only keeps your eyes and face safe from the sun, it also looks great. The article says you'll look fashionable in one of these hats while you're by the pool. Wow. Okay. So, when you're in the pool, if you wear one of these hats, it will look very fashionable. All right. Well, we've got two word power words to look at in that sentence. The first one is "to keep the sun out of your eyes." The sun will look at in that sentence. The first one is the word "while." This word is a conjunction, which means it connects two parts of a sentence. While is spelled W H I L E. While. Let's learn more about it. We use the word "while" to show that one thing happens during the time that something else is happening. For example, we could say, "Please be quiet while your brother is studying." Let's say that one more time. Please be quiet while your brother is studying. OK， 我们来看一下 while 这个连接词，就是当什么什么的时候，其实就是两件事情同时发生。我们来举个例子，我们比较清楚。比方像是哦，你出门的时候有人打来，就是 someone called while you were out， 或者是当你在洗碗盘的时候，哇，这个。电话就响了，你就可以说 The phone rang while I was doing the dishes. OK， 所以是两件事情同时发生哦。就像我们刚刚的例句提到的 ，Please be quiet while your brother is studying. 当你哥哥在读书的时候，在这段时间，你可不可以安静一点哦 ？All right. Well, the next word power word we saw in that sentence was pool. Pool is a noun. It's spelled P O O L. Pool. Let's find out more about it. So a pool is a large structure that kind of looks like a big box or container that holds enough water for someone to swim in. Pools can be really small, or small enough to go in someone's yard, or they can be really long and deep. In an example sentence, we could say, "It's so hot today. Let's go swimming in the pool." Let's say it one more time. It's so hot today. Let's go swimming in the pool. OK， 我们来看一下 pool 这个字哦，其实就是游泳池，当然我们也可以用 swimming pool 来表示。那当然要去游泳的时候，也不要忘记，你一定要怎么样呢？一定要穿上泳衣，就是 swimsuit。OK， 还有呢，嗯、um, ， you should wear maybe a。Goggles, right?、Mm, mm, okay. If you can open your eyes underwater, <laughs> 就是挖镜啦 ，G O G G L E S. 那刚刚的例句提到就是今天好热哦，我们去游泳池游泳吧。Let's go swimming in the pool.、Mm-hmm. Don't forget to wear your sunscreen too. Oh, right.、Mm-hmm. 就是擦防晒油。Okay, so I like to wear straw hats when I'm at the beach. Oh, okay. So, actually, Aaron 老师他去这个海边的时候呢，就是可以用它来遮阳，就是草帽。Yeah, it's good. It's there to protect you、mm-hmm. from the sun, of course. And it looks silly if I wear one in the office. <laughs> That's so true. Okay. Well, we have another hat to talk about. The article tells us these hats are called. Bucket hats. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Bucket hats is 什么呢？就是渔夫帽。嗯
Hmm. I hope it's not just a big bucket you go you put on your head. <laughs> That might look a bit silly. Uh huh. All right. Let's get back to the article. It tells us more about these hats. It says these hats first became popular thanks to rappers. Oh, okay. So this hat, at first, was popular because of rappers. So is thanks to kind of like saying because of? Hmm. Yeah. Okay. So here, the thanks to 就是由于或是因为怎么样怎么样 Okay. 像是比如说，呃、um, ，I'll give an example. 如果我今天呃啊，我因为养了一个新宠物，所以我就变得比较开心快乐，就可以说 I'm a lot happier these days thanks to my new pet dog.、Aww. But sometimes thanks to can also mean and like you know can be used in an ironic. Ironic way, 就是他有种啊，多亏有你哦，就是这样子，有种反讽的意思，像是 Thanks to you, we have to do the whole thing. Over again. Oh, that's not a very nice way. <laughs> All right, I think I like the puppy better. Yeah. All right, we saw another word in that sentence. It has to do with music. Let's explain the word rapper to our students. Okay, we all know rap, or、uh, rap singers. Okay, actually, it's a rapper. So rapper is, yes, it's true. It's a rapper. Can you rap, Laura? Not very well. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely cannot rap. I do like to listen to rap music,、Same. though.、Mm -hmm. Let's hear more about rap music and bucket hats. <laughs> The article says today many fans of this type of music enjoy this cool style. Hmm, 没错，其实现今呢，很多饶舌音乐的粉丝们非常喜欢戴这种酷酷风格的帽子啦。All right. Well, we had our third word power word in that sentence. In fact, I've said this word a couple of times already. It's the word "cool," which is an adjective. It's spelled C O O L. Cool. Now we use "cool" just to describe something that is fashionable or interesting or something that we like a lot. It shows approval or that you think something is good. As an example, we could say Mark thinks that he looks cool in his new jacket, so he wears it everywhere. Let's say that sentence one more time. Mark thinks that he looks cool in his new jacket, so he wears it everywhere. Cool, Mark. Okay, <laughs> 我们来看一下 cool. 其实大家应该都对这个字不陌生吧？就是很酷的、很时髦的这样的意思哦。像是我们通常看到有人戴这个 sunglasses， 就是太阳眼镜说，说 Wow, those sunglasses look cool. Okay. 或者呢，哎，如果我们说你穿什么看起来很时髦、很酷，我们可以说 You look cool in those jeans.、Oh, thanks. Yay. Okay. So 刚刚的例句的 Mark 呢，他觉得他的的新夹克看起来让他看起来很酷，所以就到处穿着它哦。Maybe it's a leather jacket. Those look cool.、Ooh. All right. So the article has more to say about bucket hats.、Mm. It says these hats look especially good when you pair them with casual clothes.、Mm. We learned this word yesterday. Yes, we did. Okay, so when you put this hat and the casual wear together, it will look especially cool. And yesterday we learned the word casual, casual casual clothes, which means casual clothes. All right. Well, we have a lot to talk about in that sentence. So let's go into learning about the word especially. This word is an adverb, and it's a long word. It's spelled E S P E C. I A L L Y, especially. Now we use the word especially when we want to say that one thing is more important than other things. For example, I can say I like lots of fruit, but I like mangoes especially. That means I like mangoes more than other types of fruit. Another example could be Rebecca likes fruit. Especially strawberries. Let's say that one more time. Rebecca likes fruit, 
especially strawberries. Hmm, I love strawberries and mangoes.、Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, we're looking at especially. Actually, it has a strong emphasis on especially, which is especially, especially, especially. So, if you like a very large amount of things, when you want to make an example, you can put especially in the middle of your favorite thing. Like we just mentioned, Rebecca likes fruit, especially strawberries. I like bright colors. I like very bright colors. Yellow, especially yellow. I think I knew that already.、Yay. Okay, then we saw the phrase "pair with." Now I know a pair means you have two parts of one thing, like a pair of shoes.、Mm. But how is it used as a verb? That's a very good question. Okay, pair 呢，其实通常我们用来当做名词或是量词，有像是一对啦、一双啊，像是 a pair of shoes, socks. Okay, 但是当做 verb， 当做动词来讲的话，我们可以是配对或是搭配这样的意思哦。Pair A with B 是 A 与 B 搭配，像是呢 the The suit is paired with black shoes for a formal look. Okay, 西装搭配黑鞋子就是嗯，要有一种比较正式的一个样式的呈现。Or sometimes you could talk about food.、Mm-hmm. The fish was paired with a white wine. Sounds delicious.、Mm. All right. Well, we saw the word casual,、mm-hmm. and we did already learn about it. But let's go over this adjective one more、mm. time. Okay, so casual is an adjective. 它是一个形容词，就是有休闲的意思。So we talked about maybe jeans, t-shirts, etc.、Mm-hmm. Okay, so that's four hats we've talked about in all: berets, baseball caps,、mm-hmm. straw hats, and bucket hats. 嗯、mm, ，OK， 所以我们都提到四种的帽子喽，就是贝雷帽啦，还有这个哦棒球帽，还有草帽，以及这个渔夫帽。Now, which one is your favorite, Aaron? Probably the beret for nice outfits、oh. and baseball caps for casual outfits. Wow. OK.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, those two are very popular for girls, right?、Mm-hmm. 所以女生通常都觉得，哎，如果我们今天要穿这种比较正式或是小洋装之类，哇，搭上贝雷帽，感觉就是嗯，很有气质。It looks classy with the berets,、mm-hmm. but baseball caps are also great. They are、mm-hmm. great for casual outfits, and yeah, I think I'll have to go for baseball caps too、mm-hmm. as my favorite type.、Mm-hmm. Okay, all right. So the article says there is a perfect summer hat out there for you. Hmm, 没错，一顶完美的夏日帽子正在等着你哦。Then the article says you can wear a fun hat to keep cool. 嗯，你也可以戴一顶哦，你可以戴一顶有趣的帽子来维持你超酷的风格。这里的 keep 注意哦，它有维持的意思哦。Okay, but that's not all. It says this is also a nice way to make you look good. Oh, okay. 但这也是让你外表加分的好方法哦。Or look cool, not just look good.、Mm. Okay, so in fact, the last line might be the most important line of all. It says, "Try wearing your favorite hat today and see for yourself." So true. Today, just 带着试着戴上你最爱的帽子吧。你自己看看就知道。这里的 "see for oneself" 就是要亲自体验，或者是你亲自看看就知道是不是真的啦。So once you put on your favorite hat, you'll see that you're feeling cool and looking cool. But that's all the time we've got for our article today.、Mm-hmm. Before our review time, let's go to our magic box. Magic box, 找亮点。大家好，我是 Celine， 欢迎来到 Magic Box 找亮点。See 除了当看。还有很多意思哦。今天想要跟大家说的就是 “see for yourself” 这样的用法。字面上来看呢，就是亲眼看看的意思。但其实大家可以想想看，这个 “see” 呢，跟我们原本的“看”意思已经不太一样了。它比较像是 “find out”，“find out”。Find out. 所以 “see for yourself” 就跟 “find out on your own” 比较类似，不一定是真的用看的，而是去体验感受一下。什么状况可以用呢？例如啊，你朋友问你说：“哎，那个 skydiving 高空跳伞好不好玩啊 ？”Was skydiving fun? Was skydiving fun? 这时候呢，你就可以回他说 ：“Why don't you see for yourself? Why don't you see for yourself?” 哎，你自己体验看看啊！这句话
这个什么时候最好用呢？就是啊，在别人问一些没必要问问的问题的时候啦，像是好不好吃啊、好不好玩啊，这些问题的答案都很主观哦。所以，与其回答好吃、好玩，不如跟他说 ，You can try and see for yourself. You can try and see for yourself. 除了你自己 ，yourself， 你也可以改成其他的反身代名词 ，himself, herself 等等都可以。例如，你朋友说他的女朋友 Maggie 不相信 skydiving 很好玩，你就可以说 ，She can try and see for herself. She can try and see for herself. 说到这里，毕竟大家这个空口说白话也是没意义啦。顺便教大家一个说法啊、哦、，seeing is believing. Seeing is believing, 也就是眼见为凭啦。让不相信的人自己看看，绝对比自己一直说好吧。啊，最后呢，就是我们的验收时间啦。考考你们哦，你不相信我的话，自己亲身去看看嘛。这句话的英文要怎么说呢？快讲，大家不要走开，答案即将揭晓哦。The answer is, if you don't trust me, you can go and see for yourself. 你答对了吗？ Wait for it! It's review time. 复习时间到喽。Hi everyone, welcome back to review time. I have some questions、oh, today.、Okay. I'm wondering if Laura was listening carefully.、Uh, I think so. Okay. Well, your first question is. Which hat makes us think about Paris, France?、Mm -hmm. Is it the bucket hat,、mm -hmm. the straw hat, or the beret? 嗯，哪一种帽子让我们会就是想到法国巴黎？当然是贝雷帽啦、啊。But C beret. That's right. All right. Question number two. What does the word power word pool mean?、Hmm. Is it A? Saying that you think something is good, B, a place where people can go swimming, or C, used to say that something is more important. I know it's not A because it sounds like cool、it、for、does. A. Okay,、mm -hmm. I think it's B. Because pool is a swimming pool, a place where people can go swimming. Great. All right, we have one more question for you. This one should be very easy, but it comes from a word power from day one.、Mm -hmm. Okay, so which word power from day one means Saturday and Sunday?、Mm. Is it weekend, baseball? Or while Saturday and Sunday, 当然就是周末啦 Of course, it's the weekend. Right. All right. Well, that's all the time we've got for our review time today.、Mm -hmm. You guys can think of some questions to ask your friends. But for now, that's all the time we've got. So for A Plus English, I'm Erin and I'm Laura. Bye bye. Bye. Hats, hats, hats. Straw hats. Keep the sun out of your eyes with the straw hat. You'll look fashionable in one of these hats while you're by the pool. Bucket hats. These hats first became popular thanks to rappers. Today, many fans of this type of music enjoy this cool style. These hats look especially good when you pair them with casual clothes. There is a perfect summer hat out there for you. You can wear a fun hat to keep cool. This is also a nice way to make you look good. Try wearing your favorite hat today and see for yourself. While. While, please be quiet while your brother is studying. Please be quiet while your brother is studying. Pool, pool. It's so hot today. Let's go swimming in the pool. It's so hot today. 
Let's go swimming in the pool. Cool. Cool. Mark thinks that he looks cool in his new jacket, so he wears it everywhere. Mark thinks that he looks cool in his new jacket, so he wears it everywhere. Especially. Especially, Rebecca likes fruit, especially strawberries. Rebecca likes fruit, especially strawberries.